Hey viewers, I'm back with another video. Um, you might have seen me do um, some repair work on this LP in one of the previous videos. Um, I did a video on uh, this James Taylor LP, um, but um, there was something that bothered me in the video, uh, so I took it down and I thought. Um, let me revisit this. Um, so, as I mentioned, well, what I mentioned in the previous video was I hadn't known any James Taylor songs really, or I hadn't known his music. I um, knew that he did the Carol King song, um, and that's about it. Uh, so, I saw this. Uh, I picked it up and um, you know, I, knowing full well that I don't really know the music um, it could have been something that I didn't um, enjoy or wouldn't have liked but I I took it and I'm actually glad I took it um, the record itself was in excellent condition there's a green Warner label. It's a 1970 South Africa pressing. Sweet Baby James. Um, yeah, so it's it's almost like it's a folk album crossed with some country and some rock and some blues influence um, genre wise and I actually enjoy this it opens up with the title track Sweet Baby James uh, Sweet Baby James um, and then Lo and Behold um, which I'm not sure what that song is about. At first I thought it was about war. Um, but I don't know, there's some other type of meaning to it. Um, you know, he goes on to say um, something about this, a well on the hill, you just can't kill for Jesus. Um, there's another song on here where he references Jesus as well. Um, we have the next song, Sunny Skies, um, then Rock Steamroller, um, but he does it in a country rock and roll um, way. Um, country Road, I enjoyed Country Road on here. Um, and then Oh Susanna, Oh Susanna, uh, which I think is a folk song. He does it very well here. Then the next side we have Fire and Rain and um, Blossom. Then Anywhere Like Heaven. Um, oh Baby Don't You Lose Your Lip On Me is a very short um, blues type of song. At, you know, at first I didn't really like it. I thought he was trying too hard um, to sound like like um, those old blues um, singers. But um, then the next song, I felt he redeemed himself for me. Um, Sweet 420G. I, I, I think that's currently um, my most, my favorite track on the LP because it starts off kind of mid tempo and um, then it, it goes into this you know blue eyed soul um, jam session a funky funky jam session that it goes into um, so yeah I enjoyed that. Um, but yeah, 
that was I think two weeks back um, that I picked this album up uh, and I've been playing it of course I'm, I'll put the, the video up at the later stage so that led me to to this it led me to this um, 1974 this I picked up for 60 bucks as well also James Taylor and um, I, I played side one of it and then I was interrupted and I couldn't finish the album um, so I have yet to listen to this album all the way through um, so yeah I, this is a UK press and when, um, when I took the album out sure it looked like it never been played I didn't see any signs of playback it looks near mint it has oh, the Warner Brother the Warner Brother label with the palm trees and yeah that's James Taylor so I I enjoyed that first album so much, that Sweet Baby James, when I saw another one of his LPs and I saw how good this condition was, no 60 and I thought that would be, let me go for it, maybe I'll enjoy this album as much as well. So um, here's to discovering uh, James Taylor. Leave your comments below, like, subscribe and thank you for watching.